Yo, what's going on guys? It is your boy Sessa here bringing some really cool fonts and recent pickups that'll hopefully help you guys heading into 2023. So without further ado, let's just get started. Also, wish me luck for eSports Awards as I did get nominated for Creative of the Year and also my Team Hunter Thieves got nominated for Creative Team of the Year. So uh, let's just, maybe we bring home a W in my, in my next video and have a nice little trophy. Maybe, who knows, we'll see. All right, first font of this video is Shabu, a unique display font with an industrial look that I think looks incredible for everyday use for your branding projects. To be honest, I really enjoy the numbers in this font with its high stance and boxy look. I don't know about you guys, but I find it pretty difficult to get a font with not just a great character suit, but great numbers too. Personally, I think this font definitely deserves a download, as I'm probably going to run this font down to the ground for the next couple of months. Up next is Douglas. It's an incredibly awesome vertical font with honestly very limited legibility, however great for typography posters are just basically short words. If you're a fan of filling space with shapes or one just like an alternative way that certainly will stand out, this font can actually probably do this for you. Not to mention, Dugas does have a very unique style that is unignorable when you actually take a closer look. I can see this font being very popular in the world of sports or esports design, so if you guys are one of those kind of people, I would download it. Following Dugas is Era 404. It's an awesome glitchy pixel kinetic feeling typeface where I believe in the right setting can push your futuristic design or theme a little bit further. I would actually highly recommend doing what this font as editor did and pairing this font with a nice clean sans serif font typeface and exchanging some of the characters for glitchy ones. You'll probably definitely see me using this in the future. Up next is Taito. Taito is a vibrant and playful typeface that features emotes as capital letters, adding characters and personality directly to your text. With its bold and friendly design, Taito is sure to make your design stand out with just a touch of warmth and playfulness. And honestly, to mention it again, the 20 plus emotes that come along with it is actually pretty clutch. And with a quick peek, each emoticon has a bunch of energy and honestly, in the right setting can create some magic. Up next, we have Gutty. It's a font that features horizontal and 45 degree diagonal lines. Each letter form is made in an abstract and dynamic way to give a unique look to the font. To be honest, if you guys were to pair this with Era 404, you probably have yourself a killer design with plenty of energy just the typeface alone. Something I took note as well was the artist showcasing this font and the neon bright color tones they used. If you're ever wondering how to actually make this font look good right away take some of the colors from this portfolio for inspiration just watch how the font gets to work for you and last up is vantage this vintage inspired font has a retro feeling with a nice modern twist inspired by the psychedelic movements of the mid 60s you can just tell that the mediums in which this font can play a role in i personally see my apparel designers actually really loving this one and i actually see a bit of like a nike sporty aesthetic in this too which tells me like with the right color scheme it can produce some freaking heat it's perfect for people looking for a dope font with a nice handwritten taste so that's the end of the video that we have here today. So hopefully you guys giving us some pretty cool fonts. In my opinion, they're pretty freaking dope. So if you guys actually have any fonts yourself that you've been using recently that you didn't see in today's video, please let me know in the comment section below. This is a font sharing safe space, okay? So if you got a killer font, just let's let the whole this let the whole world know. I understand you want to gatekeep it, but you know it is what it is. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Sesso HQ out. You're gonna keep smiling, stay positive, and stay freaking proto guys. I much love, peace, and enjoy the weekend.